Are you gonna go run? Oh. Yep. <laughs> what? Hurry, go! Yeah, we're <laughs> Under my umbrella, Ella, Ella. Hey, hey, okay. Come on. Come on. So as you guys can see, uh, it's raining again, and it's only supposed to get worse as the week goes on. So today it's kind of like a mild rain. Tomorrow we're supposed to get some storms starting. Thursday it's supposed to be flooding. Friday possible flooding and then the storms finish up Saturday. So that's fine. My pants are soaked. But we got some food for the night. Matt hasn't eaten all day and it's like seven o'clock, so. Who's gonna talk first? I guess I just did. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I guess just to be honest, it's it's the next day already. Um from that I guess the vlog that I don't know, I'm confused. Don't confuse them. I'm confused. Didn't have a great day. I guess yesterday uh, it wasn't bad it was just one of those days where you expect something and you get nothing of what you expected or you can't do anything about it either it's I don't know it, there's just days that you just go into kind of like this lull and that's what happened to me I guess yesterday so <laughs> the end yeah <laughs> well guys have fun out there <laughs> did some sales um, or not really like uh, it's not that I didn't get sales it's just that I didn't even have a chance to get sales uh, that's what bothers me the most um, and so of course you know anyone's work uh, that's kind of what hurts the most I guess whenever you you can't even do your job I guess I was doing my job I was helping train and so on not the way you wanted to yeah and I just didn't eat all day I had some water and just to get even weirder I didn't go to the bathroom I was, I just sat in that car and literally like went door to door but stayed outside uh, so didn't do anything that I'm used to doing uh, and it's just weird to me and so it's I mean there's days where I'll actively almost choose to not really do sales I'll just kind of do maintenance and admin and stuff like that but no yesterday was just nothing I just feel like I got nothing done except like loss of gas and driving around a car that's not mine and so yeah I guess just got back and got in this this mood where I just didn't want to move food helped <laughs> <laughs> that's really all it takes sometimes is just uh, doing something that you want to do it'll just snap you back into reality I guess or not reality but you know a place where you want to be so how do you overcome those days? food <laughs> more food um, yeah, I don't know it, it was it, for me it's really just it's easy to come back out of it like I don't let it sit around for days not even more so hours like I didn't even start feeling that way until it started raining and we were heading back. So it was like already mid-afternoon or late afternoon, I guess. It was probably late afternoon. Uh, then I got back and uh, there was other like, client issues and stuff like that, which happens, you know. And uh, I'm very good at taking care of those for the most part. And so, but it's just, they're hurdles. The more hurdles that you have in that mood, it's just, everything just kind of keeps beating you down until you change that. So uh, it's more so just mental and then, yeah, food. Food helps. Or just doing something that you want to do, but the underlying factor probably yesterday was food. I, I'm not gonna lie about that. I didn't eat all day. No breakfast. I tried to feed you in I know. the morning. Well, so I, I don't like eating in the morning. Um, I like eating lunch and on, just because I don't know. I'm too like I just have too much to do in the morning. And so if I want to run too in the morning, I don't want to run with food in me, because then I just start tasting it. Yeah, it's not very fun. Yeah, and I guess I could have run. And that's another thing. I wanted to run yesterday. I don't, I don't care if uh, it's sprinkling. I'm just going to go. And then I just got in that, like, I just stayed in that mood. I just sat in that chair back there. Yeah. It's pretty, it's a pretty comfortable chair. And so uh didn't really do a whole lot. Just kind of sat there until Blair was like, okay, let's go get food. Like, until so we went to the grocery store. Yeah, I keep saying the word food. So how do you feel today? Hungry. No, just kidding. Uh, I feel fine today. It's just, I need to get my day started, but 
It's eight this morning. There's a bunch of there's like a herd of deer. I don't know if I can get that. Probably not. On deer. All right, fine. Today I'm already feeling better, like more optimistic. Uh, I don't have a lot of sale things going on until later this week, and so today it's more just thinking through like the show that might get canceled because of weather, but it's not being canceled yet, so we're having to wait till three hours before the show just to be able to find out if we're going to play it or not. So we have to have all of our equipment like basically loaded up already. Uh, the guy that's you know an hour away, he has to come down and meet with us uh, beforehand. We might be staying in Austin. We might be staying in Austin during that time, so I may be close to an hour away um, and still have to come back and load my things up, and again, in a car that's not mine and probably too small for the drums. But that's, so that's just another thing, just kind of a lot of things weighing on me. I uh, can't work on the house because of the rain. Maybe it's the rain that's bringing me down. It definitely doesn't help. I don't know. It doesn't stop. But it's just one of those times like you, it's not that I don't have energy, it's just I don't have energy, you know? It's like it's there. I, I just need something to, like, spark it and set you know it off. motivation? I have to ignite it. Is it called motivation? I don't know. Yeah, I guess we can go to the gym today, maybe. I'll wait down for that. Yeah, I mean, I need to get work done first. Um, my schedule's pretty open now. It's like I can maneuver it however I need to based around just uh, goals. So we did. We had a really, like, a record-setting month this last month. Uh, we're already trending to have a really good month this month. Um, I'd like one more big sale to actually push that for me and usually if I'm if I'm in good standing at work uh, then I feel like everything else helps got a big sale coming soon here and then there's that so she was in the hospital for a day and like that just like it throws a, a wrench in everything like you, you just don't know what to expect next or like you don't like you lose a couple of days like days that you mm -hmm. you had set definitely time lost yeah lots of time from that just because mm -hmm. we were both so tired last yeah. week exactly because I had plans for those days to get uh, the circular rebar to have it set out here to be ready to to work on stuff. Of course, then I didn't know the rain was going to happen the next week. I had plans to sit around a lot. <laughs> you got that. <laughs> you did that. <laughs> no, I didn't so have you're plans. on track. Didn't have plans to be in the hospital. That's why you're all motivated. <laughs> that stress. Yeah, and now she's rolling around on balls and leaning over doing cat cows and <laughs> stuff like that, trying to get this baby out. And I'm like, hold on, because like I have two more shows possibly. So one show tomorrow, tomorrow, possibly one show possibly tomorrow. It has a big question mark on that, and then a show definitely on Saturday. We're ready for it, except that song. We're we're playing two, I think two or three covers, and then one of those covers, I always miss a beat, and literally like I, that's not a phrasing. I literally miss a beat. Uh, it's Neon Moon, towards the end. You should know that song really well. Yeah. Uh, there's a snare hit right after a long sustained note held by vocal, but I I don't count because. The vocalist cuts out and feels out how long he wants to hold it. And so I have to time whenever he's done holding it to hit the and, <laughs> and then we come back in on one. It's not that technical, it's just basically I'm saying that I have to just know the song really well. So I need to listen to it a couple more times and get used to it. How do we get here? <laughs> yeah, so I'm just spiraling, just, just venting a little bit. And it's not like bad venting as you can tell, it's just like... There's a lot on my mind, and that's not even, that's not even close to being all of it, but it's most of it. Having to buy a truck right now, looking at different trucks, uh, just played around with the idea of 250s. We're not going to do a 250, guys. Not doing an F250. No, it's exponentially more expensive, too. Yeah, I mean, gas gets cut cut in half. Um, yeah. <laughs> that's if we do unleaded gas instead of diesel. Uh, that's just put it in those terms. Uh, maintenance on them are crazy. Uh, resale value's good. See, we're playing around with it, but it's not it's not good. We're probably going to do a F-150 EcoBoost, uh, more than likely going used. I'm leaning towards CarMax, even though I don't really like CarMax, just because of the selection, not the prices. So that's kind of what it comes down to at this point. We're not in that much of a hurry, but kind of in a hurry. We want a truck now. Mm -hmm. Well, we yeah. need to get back to our own car versus yeah. borrowing. I mean, we, we could get a rental. It's, it's on the insurance, but... So Maybe yeah, that's on my mind, too. Small little thing, yeah. What else? What else you got? What else? Mm -hmm. I have dogs outside. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's not raining right now. I expect it's already be raining. And so I was like, that's also a thing. It's like you plan on negative weather affecting your day. And so you plan your day around that. Like we instead keep of getting flash flood warnings yeah. already. So. so instead of like actually doing sales that I want to do today, I'm like going to do calls, which I don't do this early. So like I, I can do like emails and things, but I don't really want to call too many places until they're actually opening. 
because I don't want to be that guy. I'm already that guy making these calls, right? Come by my website. I don't know. I feel better today. Okay. I'll go get a workout in. I don't want to run on a treadmill, though. I still don't trust my knee. You'll feel real good after a workout and some food. We should have worked out this Y'all morning. Y'all don't skip meals, okay? <laughs> we'll just don't skip as many meals as I did. It's like whenever you skip all of the meals, that's probably yeah. not great. Or don't go from eating normally to skipping all of the meals. Yeah, because you can do like successful fasting if you plan it out right. And mm-hmm. Give your body time to adjust, but don't... Or do cleanses, but I mean, that's a slippery slope too. You want to... Is that... Is that... You feel better? Yeah, I just want to get some stuff done. So what it comes down to is productivity. If I get things done and I expect that they should be done, like, I guess switch that order. If I, like, I have set goals and I get those goals finished or accomplished, that's whenever I'm in a good mood. Filming this vlog right now, that's already one one thing, but I need, like, yeah, check. I need, like, eight more things. Let's go start them. So, all right. I guess those will be in the next vlog. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, see you tomorrow. I guess you can see how I uh, accomplish things and feel better see and stuff, you know. All right. Y'all have fun out there. Have fun. (laughs) Just a second. That's bad. (laughs) That's the next (laughs) checkbox. That's bad. (laughs) That's all of our dishes, pretty much. That's just dinner. I told you, I, I ate all the meals in one dinner. I started feeling a little better. So, but. <laughs>